What a week it's been. Yeah. This time last week, Zoe was in her pit with a cold. And she had a terrible headache and she felt, it felt like somebody was sitting on her head. <laughs> and uh, then I caught it. So I was in, the, in my pit for uh, a few days with the same cold, I think. Yeah. Um, but then today... Chaz's phone saying he's got a cold. <laughs> he's got a cold, yeah. We're supposed to be meeting Chaz at this place uh, on our campsite. Yeah. But not only has he got a cold, but his motorhome has got a few faults with it, a few problems. First of all, he found a screw in one of the tyres. Yeah. So he's had to fix that. He fixed that. And his fresh water tank leaks. He's also fixing that. But uh, yeah, so he's going to be late. About it's, half nine yeah, or something, Yeah, he's gonna, isn't it? it's going to be probably dark by yeah. the time he gets We've back. We've been told that we've got to be the wardens when he arrives because everyone else <laughs> isn't going to be available. Yeah. Should we let him in? But where are we, though? <laughs> where are we? We are at Field Barn Park yep. in um, Borton on the Water. Yep. So it's about 20 minutes walk, isn't it? That's into right. Into the, the main so, town. Yeah. So that's quite nice, isn't it? So it's a bit nearer than the nice one that short we stayed walk. at before. Yes. Get to all the facilities and yes. stuff. Yeah. And the campsite <clears throat> is looking really lovely, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, admittedly, you haven't got views here, have you? You've just got lots of trees. No, everyone's all cordoned and, off. So yeah. they can't see anybody. No, but we were going to have a wander around. But it's a special we? campsite, though, isn't it? It's adults it's only. Yes. And the funny thing was, yes, it's over 30s, isn't it? And yeah. we had to show our ID at reception. We had to show our ID at the reception. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to get a lot of that, oh, I think, for, during, the, uh, during the video. Yeah. But uh, anyway, stick around and, and stay, stay tuned. tuned. That looks good. While we're waiting for Chaz, um, we're going to show you around the campsite because we haven't wandered around yet and it sounds interesting. So follow us. This is a typical pitch. This is number 13, which we've got. And then we've given the largest one, number 14, to Chaz and Liz. So there is a main toilet block. But then there are two of these little tiny cubicles, I suppose, and they have names. This one... It's Bob Ross. It's called Bob Ross. Do you think we should be showing right. toilets? Come there on. you go. I'm being a Bob Earnshaw and showing you the toilet blocks. It's all very clean and tidy, though. <coughs> and tiny. The other, and the other one's called Walter, Waterloo, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Which makes me laugh. While Zoe is uh, having a bit of a relaxing moment there, I'm going to show you just here is the recycling area. <clears throat> so we have, you know, cans and paper and whatnot. Uh, we have uh, tin cans and uh, glass. And then we also have the uh, grey waste and chemical disposal point, which is just a hole in the ground by the looks of things. But where Zoe is, is uh, the washing up facilities in there. And they're still using the COVID rules, so only two people at a time. You've got the hand sanitizer. And then around the side here of this lovely little uh, building are the toilets. So here's the gents. Um, oh, just looks like a normal toilet, if you ask me. And a couple of showers, three showers, all open by the looks of things. And it's a very clean toilet. So do excuse me while I use the facilities. So here we have reception. Uh, it's just through there. But of course, we're, everyone's meeting outside. But over here, we have the information room. Sorry, information shed. <clears throat> and where we'll find Zoe in the... Uh, yeah. What is it called? What do you think this is called? Like the, the butchery like kind a, of thing? Groceries. Grocery and butchery. You've got ice cream in there. You've got local Sausages. meats in this fridge and in that one as well. Beef burgers. Wow. Steaks. Look at those steaks. Wow. Wow. Lots of ice creams. So each item has an honesty jar. 
the ice creams, those tubs are £2.50 each. There's the meat only one. And then we have the eggs, milk and beans, etc. See this here, this, this elephant grass, it's very tall, that's way taller than me, this grass. Um, it's, that makes a big cross through the campsite. And then in the corners where the cross meets, uh, are these little alleyways where you can walk into the center. There's a flag just there, which tells us that's the center apparently. So this is the uh, elephant grass. So you can see how tall they are. Very tall. So is she tall? And you've got Very these tall. weird fruits, haven't you? On the now, oh, it's getting windy. <laughs> we need to move on because I could get turned around here. So let's go through that way. Oh no, he's got a water thing there, fire extinguisher. There we are. Oh, and you walk up. There we are. So this is now the, one of the corners of the campsite. Oh, and then Herman should be up here somewhere. But yeah, you can see how big the pitches are. Look at that one, it's massive. And this VW has a reasonable sized pitch as well. Yeah, see, you can't see Herman, can you? He's along here somewhere. Oh, there he is. He's still there, right? Still. He hasn't gone without it. Yeah, there we are. We're back. Okay, still no Chaz. <laughs> it's uh, just gone seven. And uh, so we've decided to tuck into our curry that we cooked yesterday and reheated today. Uh, chicken curry, mango sauce, rice, naan bread. And of course some wine. So um, while he's still coming along, we're going to tuck into this. Can't wait for him any longer. No, can't wait. We just watched the entire box set of Friends and uh, still no Chaz. Still no Chaz. So I don't know where he is. I'm I think though pooped, I'm, I'm going to get back to my Encyclopedia <laughs> Britannica. Um, I've almost finished that as well. So uh, look at the time, quarter yeah. to ten. Quarter to ten. Oh bloody <clears throat> hell! And if you still not uh, come back after me watching, uh, I've read that. Uh, I think the extended version of Lord of the Rings and uh, full box set of uh, twenty four. I think we'll have to start <laughs> watching as well. Wow! But uh, yeah. <laughs> Unbelievable. Two thousand years later. Here they are. They finally come here. Oh, we got to get off the road. What time do you call this? Who is in his Hawaiian shirt? Look. Here we are. We just gate crashed. Yeah, we're in the back of Chaz and Liz's motorhome. At ten o'clock. Giving them directions to the site. Well, I hope it's Chaz and Liz. I can't really you tell know, them it's done. You could have been kidnapped. <laughs> I know. I believe you found some people on the road. No, neither can I. Yeah, we should have run them over, though. Yeah, it's a lot better place when during the daylight. Oh, I've been here. Yeah, it looks really nice, actually. Yeah. It's obviously the following day, and uh, we found eventually we come across Liz and Chaz, and. Uh, Actually, we met you last night at this very spot just here. After a bottle of wine. Doesn't it look different? <laughs> Doesn't it? Yeah. We can see the point. <laughs> but right now, it's, um, it's gone lunchtime, so we're really lazy, but uh, we're heading into Borton on the Water. It's um, a 20 minute walk away um, across some fields. Not entirely sure where we've got to go though, but hopefully, we'll get there eventually and i'm expecting huge crowds right well we get out of the campsite and we see this spectacular view and we've got to walk in that direction down there <laughs> what are you talking about are you talking more bs again yes yeah because <laughs> this is this is an ostrich field right didn't you know that? Oh, oh, unbelievable <sighs> got a new job Yeah, hold on, hold on, I'm gonna throw it. Ready? Ready? This is a mistake, Ready? Ready? No, 
Oh, he's never going to let you not go that way. Oh, <laughs> got there, mate. Oh, oh God. What, there? <laughs> what was that? <laughs> what did you just say? I said it's the problem with having a YouTube. We get all this faffing about and we don't get going. Oh Jesus, we need to <laughs> We stopped on this dodgy bridge, look, that's why I put my foot, stood through that. Anyway, we're going now. <sighs> Got him. Oh. He's alright. Hold on. Right, we are making our way very quickly across this field because just over there, you might not be able to see them, there's three bulls. But uh, the bullocks are not coming this way anymore, so we're, we're doing well. We've lost the path. That there is Borton on the water. You were like that once. Matt, look, he's looking at me. Oh! <laughs> As you would expect, this place, or as we expected, because we've been here before bank holiday, in fact it was probably last year, um, heaving here, absolutely heaving. Just take a look behind me, oh, everyone along the bank here, uh, against uh, right next to the river. River is not that deep either, so people just, and dogs, just uh, wander in. And we have uh, a few of these be beaches, a few of these uh, bridges that people can walk across. <laughs> Clarence is after the toys. Well, Chaz tries on a hat. Well, it's like now. <laughs> Clint Eastwood. Yeah. Chaz, why don't you try on other hats? I don't want that. Found it. I don't know. This one yeah, looks good. One. I think that one will suit you. Well, try that one on. Yeah, but what yeah, about no, the hat? That bad. looks. That's no. That's better. Nah, it's not. That's horrible. That's a lot better hat. No, I like this one. Oh, will it live? Let me what do you think about this? It looks a bit. No. No. What do you think, folks? Look at Zoe's. Mine doesn't fit on my head. Oh, look at Zoe. Here's Joe's. Do you think? Oh, look I'm at gonna, her there. I'm back to front. <laughs> no, I think her head's on back to front. No. There you go. That's, that's it. I can't she can't see, see now. It that's... suits you. <laughs> it it's okay. It doesn't see me. I might just keep with my... Um... Tilly. Tilly. Yeah. Chaz has bought us an ice cream. What have you got there? Naughty Chaz. You said it's what? Cookies and cream. Yeah. And... Cherry Bakewell or something? Oh yes, that's right, Cherry Bakewell, yeah. And I've got um, nice. salty caramel and uh, rum and raisin. Mm. What about you, Chaz? What have you got? Double rum and raisin. Double rum and raisin. A little whiskey. And a new hat by the looks of things. Yeah, a new hat. Yeah. <laughs> Pink one didn't make it. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Uh, Liz, what have you got? I've got salted honeycomb and salted caramel and it's lovely. Lovely. And what about, no, you haven't got one, have you? No. He's interested in going in there, though. Look at that. <laughs> Boop. <laughs> so it's very busy here, but uh, only a small amount of people are wearing the masks. <clears throat> Not that there's a problem. I don't feel like uh, insecure or anything with the old COVID, but just a few people wearing masks now. Well, we're at the Cotswolds Antique and Tea Room. There's a load of antique shops in Bortland of Water. But what got me interested was these teapots. Now, look at the size of those. Hate to have a cup of tea out of those. Not hardly worth a gulp. Yeah, Clowns has just spotted a statue and he's, he's a bit curious. Oh, it's not real, Karen. That's smudge on the lenses now, though. <laughs> How beautiful is that? Now, Cotswolds is famous for the, um, the sandstone, that yellow sandstone. And, of course, uh, Borton is full of it.
Got all this up here. Right, we're heading back to the campsite now. Hopefully we're not going to get lost because we got lost coming here. But uh, yeah, back to the campsite for some nosh, I think. Right, well, we found out where we went wrong. Um, we're just about to cross into the ball field again. Yeah, there's a ball just there, it's just started staring at us. And we're following this, well, it looks like a path. There's one just over there. And before we just walked straight across, we completely missed that sty over there. That's not a cow. Jeez, look at this, it's got a fifth leg. Hello. Right. <laughs> Faster than you. That's all I need. <laughs> yeah, so this is the path we followed. And it goes up in that direction. We've just come across here and there's no path. We are now in uh, Chaz and Liz's motorhome motor uh, eating lasagna, homemade by Liz. Mm. Uh, <laughs> no, very nice. Yes, and we're going to tuck into that, and we'll see you in the morning. Bye. Say goodbye, folks. Bye. 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 All right, Chaz, what are you doing? Hello, mate. Yeah, nice. No, checking the gas locker. Got to tell you, I took the little man, Clarence, for a walk this morning. Yeah. And we get in the field, you know, and I let him off to leave, you know, have his little run around. And I turn around, he's 50, 60 yards back. Yeah. Come on, Clarence. What's he doing? He's found something, you know. But you know, he's like so obedient. Clarence, come, he's sitting looking at me. So, what's he doing? So, I start walking back towards him. And as I'm walking towards him, as I'm getting closer, the face is going more and more sudden. I'm thinking, what's wrong? And as I get 20 yards, <laughs> and I'm thinking, what's this? Thorn. Oh, really? Yeah, and he's like, poorly, not moving. <laughs> It hurts. So I'll come here then. Pull the phone out. Yelp. <laughs> right, right. Looks at me as if I've now hurt him. Yeah. Won't forgive me, obviously. And I yeah. said, no, no, it's okay. You're okay. Oh, <gasps> and runs off. <laughs> but it was, oh, literally, it was literally medic. <laughs> poorly. <laughs> not moving. Like, uh, you come here. I'm like, not. Oh, poor. <laughs> like, yeah. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah. Dogs. Dogs. Yeah. We're uh, just doing a cycle ride and uh, come across this. Hello. Bye bye. Hello. Goodbye. Hello. Goodbye. <laughs> Thank you and you. That was all very nice, wasn't it? Oh goodness. Take a look at this rickety old bridge. Really worn, look. Wow. Of course, no fish in here. So this is supposed to be a road. It's more like a goat track. Look at this place. This is called Upper Slaughter, and uh, it's all the full of Cotswolds style buildings. <laughs> Going around here, all the sandstone buildings. Look, 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 look. Beautiful place. Oh wow. <laughs> now there's a Ford at the bottom. Oh, that was a bit deep. Let's see it go down. Here comes another one. S slowly, slowly. Ooh. Almost lost the front then. 
Right, Chaz is, uh, have decide, has decided that he's going to go through gonna the Ford. Are you ready? I'm ready. Yeah. I'm going to be holding the camera. If anything goes wrong, and of course that is on an electric bike. <laughs> if you ever come to Bourton on the Water, check out this car park. It might only be open at weekends. Uh, this is kind of a temporary car park created by the Cotswolds College or Cotswolds School, I think it is. We've parked here a few times and I think it's something like £4 when we, uh, when we came here. It is a lot better than the other car parks here and of course you can't really park in the high street. So check out this car park if you come to Bourton on Water. So in a first... Um, we're going to summarise what we think about this campsite, uh, Field Barn Park, just southwest of Bourton and Bourton on the Water. Um, yeah, some pros and cons. We're going to rattle through them. It's not going to be a huge conversation. I'm just going to speed blah, through blah, 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 blah. them. Yeah, <laughs> speed through them. <clears throat> so pros. This yes. is your writing. <laughs> And you can't read it. I know it's a bit of a scribble. Well, we've we, we found that there's more pros than cons. Okay, the we? list is longer. That field barn park. Yeah. Um, so what we really like about this is very different to standard camping and caravan or, or the motorhome and caravan or whatever. It's you've got your private little individual pitches and you're surrounded by bushes, aren't you? You can't yeah. see your neighbours. Not really. So no. um, yes, it's very secluded. Mm. Um, very pretty. Lots of nature. Um, Seen a deer. Yes. Apparently, there's barn owls here. Is there? Yeah. Ah. And bats. Yes, bats at the reception up the other end, isn't there? But yes, lots of wildlife. Yeah. Um, so yeah, we've really enjoyed it. They haven't got any hard standing, which hasn't been a problem because it's been dry all weekend hasn't it but they say that it's fast draining i was gonna say Ground, fast draining grass, grass. Yeah. <laughs> that yeah. doesn't sound quite right uh let's, let's rattle through these though oh yeah um so uh we all got all units all units tents we can have here caravans yeah. and motorhomes. homes yeah uh quiet it's very quiet yes. site. adult site so you've got to be over 30 i think they said so yeah. we just about got in there uh, we've mentioned the wildlife. Uh, loads of walks from here, I guess. Yes, and very close to Borton on the Water, wasn't it? Yeah, it's like 20 a 20 minutes. minute walk. Yes. The thing is, it's a hill, so coming back, it'd be longer. Yes, it's a bit of heavy breathing. Uh, but that's by field or by road. Yeah. Um, cycling routes. Uh, yeah, we did a cycling route. Uh, Toilet block is clean. Very clean. Yeah, it does yes. seem a bit quite. It does seem a bit small. We've um, wow three cubicles, uh, shower cubicles, and also because you've got lots of tents here, you know, you yeah. feel that you want to use your own facilities, don't you? Um, loads of recycling options, yes. cardboard and everything. It's all set out they in even give you a boxes. bag for your food waste, which we've never seen before. We do that at home, but never on a campsite. Um, <clears throat> private pictures, interesting layout. layout. Oh yeah, the layout's very interesting. I mean, I cross. think we've got some good pictures, haven't we, with mm. um, Chaz and Large size pictures. Yeah, because we're right at the back of the campsite, whereas in the middle, <clears throat> you've got smaller ones for the tents, haven't you? Oh, and we haven't mentioned, right in the middle of the campsite, you've got all the elephant grasses yeah. and things, haven't you? Yeah. So yes, it's very um, unusual. Very, very unusual yes. site. Uh, right, okay, so on to our Cons. We haven't got many of those. We don't, no. We have uh, no general waste. Have we mentioned that before? We couldn't find the general waste. No. I think what they're trying to do, though, is encourage you to take it home. Recycle everything as much as possible and mm. take home your as little as possible, your yeah. general waste. But mm. uh didn't say any signs about that. Uh, you've, um, you said that. Uh, no hard standing, no. What's that? Can't oh, see oh, yeah. the scenery. Yes, because the... Bushes or the hedges are very high mm. above the motorhome, so when you look out, all you can see is um, a hedge Nothing. all the way round, yeah. can't you? We're surrounded by farmland, though, so it's not uh, unless you're on a high uh, high elevation, you're not going to see much. I don't think, anyway. Mm. What do you think? Well, yes, that's right. And if you go out of the campsite, you've got all the walks, haven't you, and the, everything? So it doesn't mm. matter no. about the pitch, does it? No, uh, but you're surrounded by nature, <coughs> like we said earlier. Yes. Uh, now we wasn't too sure whether or not this is a pro con. This one. So it's on its own. Yeah. Um, there's no lighting here. 
unlike your traditional campsites, there's no lighting, which means at night it's very dark. Now, you might not like that, um, but you might love that if you uh, nice. like seeing a star starry sky. So, yes. there you go. So, out of five, we're going to give it four Hermans. Not stars, Hermans. That is our look at the campsite in a quick manner, I hope. Under four minutes. Oh, my goodness. We've been rattling on, haven't we? Uh, so, thanks very much for watching, and goodbye. <laughs> Ah, so he wasn't expecting that all of a sudden, wasn't it?